and it looks like I have over a hundred thousand medals. What? <laughs> so the person that gave me uh, over a hundred thousand medals uh, goes by the name of Jbro129. I saw it on my Twitter as well. Uh, if you're watching this, Jbro129, uh, thank you, buddy. I really appreciate that. You did not have to do that. Hey guys, Jbro here, and I'm here with a new video. And in this video, I'm gonna be giving Big B Stats 100,000 clan medals. Now, if you guys don't know who Big B Stats is, or if you guys don't know who the YouTuber is, then he basically is by far the biggest Pix Country YouTuber right now, with 1.6 million subscribers as I'm recording this. So, in the past, I have given clan medals to my own clan, or random clans that I come across. I've given it to the top five clans on the leaderboards. And basically, in this video, I'm going to be giving it to Bigby Stats' clan. So, I actually had to go through his comment section to get his ID, because his ID and his clan ID wasn't directly shown in his videos. So, what I had to do is I basically did that. I found his ID, went to his clan, I changed my ID to his ID, and I basically got access to his clan. So if you guys may, some of you guys might think this is fake, or maybe it's not real, or some of you guys might be skeptical if I actually did this or not. So if you guys think that, that's completely understandable, but Big B Stats even uploaded a video talking about this. He thanked me, he responded to me on Twitter, all screenshots and links will be in the description down below. He even, yeah, he even responded to me on Twitter about it. He said thank you. So today is actually Mother's Day, 5-13. 2018, and I actually recorded this video yesterday, which is when I did it. He today actually responded, and he said thank you on Twitter. So, yeah, I mean, if you guys think this is fake, and it, there's not really much it, much proof that this is fake, and there's a lot of proof that this is real. So, if you guys think this is fake, it's just not. So, yeah, what I actually did was, in my other videos where I gave medals or I gave myself coins or gems, I had to remount the news button. So as you guys can see underneath all these buttons, I actually added a new mod where I can add coins and gems just by clicking a button in the mod menu. The earlier mods, what I had to do was I had to click the news button to add things. So basically what I did now is I can add things such as coins, gems, I can remove coins, gems, keys, and I can do all of that without needing to use the news button. So that means I can do it in game, I can do it basically whenever I want. There's still the news button because that's the only way you can add rating, which is uh, the trophies. But yeah, as you guys can see, this does work. I can add coins, gems, I would add keys, but there's no thing that uses keys right now. I'm going to turn on some of my mods so I can do a siege later, because I'm planning on doing at least one siege with this clan, which is, you know, might as well get them, <laughs> get them some, a siege win or whatever. But yeah, so I'm going to turn on my mods. Uh, let's turn them, yeah, turn that one on, that one. I'll shotgun, definitely that one. Uh, I don't know, yeah, let's do that one. Any password? Um, silent inbox, yeah, I love that one. And basically, now we're going to go and we're going to add the medals. Now, I have a button on here called Add 999 Medals. As of recording this, he had literally, tw uh, let's see, let me move my mod menu out of the way for me a second. Uh... He had barely any medals. Look at that. 62 overall overall clan medals. Now what I'm going to do is I'm of course going to plug myself because if I'm going to be doing this video, I might as well give myself credit for it. Because actually in Bigby Stats' video, which if you guys haven't seen already, like I said it earlier in this video, I will link it down in the description down below, he actually said that I did it. And I did do it, so that makes sense. But some people in the description down below, in his, or not in the description, in the comment section of his video, said that he did it. Which doesn't make much sense, because I am doing this video right now. Literally, 100,000 medals would cost a crap ton of money, and I managed to get it for him for free, of course, because I have my mods, but still. Like, so many people are telling me, or telling him that he did it, and I didn't. Which doesn't really make much sense, because I, basically this video is proof, his video is proof, I am literally in his clan, as I'm recording this, literally, I don't know why it says 11 clan members when there's only, <laughs> there's only 5 people in this clan and it says that there's 11, I don't know what's going on there. But yeah, as you guys can see, I am actually as Bigby Stats' ID, I changed my ID to his, 
which is basically how I came into this clan and I got access to everything. And basically, I'm going to just click on Add 999 Medals. Look at that. He now has a lot of medals, and I'm just going to spam click that because that is what the mod does. For the great part about this mod now is that I can add medals without needing to be in the main menu screen. So basically, I could basically add medals without being on the main menu screen. Which is very helpful because now I can go and I can go to the clan view where it says I add medals and I can see it go down. Which is basically what the mod menu does. And which is what the add medals does because look at that. Whenever I click add 999 medals, it will add the medals and then it'll type in chat, blah blah blah, my name has purchased 999 medals for the clan. Now if it says 1998 or 1998, that means I clicked it twice and it registered it twice before adding. So now look at that, 100,000 medals. That is, okay, I don't know off the top of my head how much money that is, but literally, that is at least a couple thousand dollars because I think you can buy like 4,000 for $100 if I'm not mistaken. I don't completely remember. If I remember by the time I'm editing this video, I'll add up, a, a, what's it called? I'll add a thing on the screen for the amount of money that I basically gave to him for free. If I don't, then I, <laughs> then I forgot, my bad. But yeah, so as you can see, now he has over 100,000 clan medals. Now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to plug myself right here so he knows who I am because, as you guys know, 1.6 6 million subscribers with a good amount of viewers, a good amount of subscribers, with a good amount of everything pretty much. So right now I'm just going to say, you're welcome. And now, yeah, let's do a siege because, I mean, cookie crumblers, it's not, it's not every day that people get to be in another YouTuber's clan. And yeah, I'm actually going to go to the leaderboards because I want to show off my main clan. Because a lot of people are, are um, you know, my clan was called JRonation 3.0. What I did was I actually had to delete that clan because I wanted to push for uh, leaderboards. I wanted to push to be one of the top clans in the game. And the problem with that was, is that my old clan, which was JRonation 3.0, actually had a custom logo. Which made it so I couldn't be in the leaderboards. Now I don't know. I don't know the reasoning behind that. That's just what I figured out because there's not many things that happen in my clan that would make me not be in the leaderboards. So right now, I actually am on the leaderboards as of recording this. I'm number three, and I have um, Jaber Nation 4.0 pretty much. That's basically who I am, and uh, that's my clan pretty much. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go and play a siege. So yeah, let's do that. Let's go to, let's let it load, and Cookie Crumblers, that's Big B Stats' clan. And if you're watching this Big B Stats, thank you for the video you did. Thank you for spawning on Twitter. I really appreciate it. Thank you for hearting my comments in your video. I am very thankful. Your videos are really good, and I'm glad to have made you happy by giving you medals. Because I posted things on Instagram where he just looked shocked because, like, imagine this. You go into your clan one day, and you have, and everything's fine, nothing's changed, but then you go again a couple hours to a day later, and you have unlimited, basically, 100,000 clan medals. Like, that's insane. Now, I know by uploading this video, I will get people saying, oh, give this YouTuber medals, or oh, give me medals. Uh, okay. I, right now, as I'm recording this, have 220,000 subscribers. Thank you. But, with imagine this. If every single person wanted medals, and I'm one person, nobody else has my mod besides me, imagine how much work that would be to give each person, each clan, that many medals. It takes me a good 5-10 minutes for me to change my ID to somebody else's. But imagine if I were to do that times 220,000 people. That would be insane. So you can of course type your clan ID in the, in the uh, comment section, but I don't. I'm not promising you that I'll be able to do it. I mean, this is a targeted video towards Big B Stats because he's a big YouTuber and I like what he does on YouTube. But like, I I can't I can't give random people medals. So you have to understand that that if you you think okay when I release my mod menu, I may or may not at have the funk the I may or may not have the mod where you can add clan medals. I'm still deciding that because maybe legal trouble might happen. I have no idea. I'm still working on that part. But yeah, so 
Uh, basically, yeah, I'm not going to be giving everybody medals. This was just a special video for Biggie Stats. And yeah, this is just to show that I, I, I like his content. I like what he does. I like how, I like his audience. I like him. He's a really good guy. He's nice. He's funny. He is, he has a sense of humor and he's a YouTuber and not all YouTubers are nice. Some people behind the scenes might be fake. Some people behind the scenes might be different, but he is real. And I really like that about him, which is why I gave him the medals. He does a variety of content, like I said earlier, make sure to subscribe to him because he is a very good guy. So now we're just going to finish up this siege and then I'm going to wrap up this video because look at that. We are, we have about a little bit less than a minute left and then we are going to end the video because that's what we want to do. 45 seconds left, let's continue and I swear I'm... I, lately, I've been recording my videos on my tablet, which is somewhat new, and I, like, I keep, okay, whenever I hover over somebody, I'm not bad at Pixcom 3D. I, yes, I use mods, but, like, that doesn't make me trash at the game. So, whenever I try to run over somebody, or try to snipe somebody, I would click at a certain spot, because I usually play either on my iPad or my main phone, which the problem is, is that it's very different looking and very different screen wise where the shoot button is. So I sometimes miss. And let's, we're getting off topic. The siege is almost over. And yeah, let's just finish this up. Um, one second left. Oh my god. I did not just do that. Oh, oh my god. No. <laughs> Room is unavailable. Okay. That, that's, that's a load of crap. Oh my god, that's actually, that's actually hilarious. Okay, so if you guys don't know what just happened, I accidentally clicked the multitasking button on my tablet because my tablet is the Galaxy Tab A. Or, sorry, the Galaxy... Yeah, the, wait, give me a second, I'm trying to remember. The Galaxy Tab... Sorry, Galaxy Tab S2, my bad. Not Tab A, that's a very different tablet. So basically, what just happened is I clicked the multitasking button, which is on the left side of the home button. And what I did is I clicked that, and it brought up the multitasking screen where I had I accidentally exited it out of Pikmin 3D. What that did was it changed the server and it glitched the g game making it so I leave the lobby. So basically the last three minutes of me recording and in, inside a siege was basically for nothing. Literally. Like it I won the siege, but he didn't get the siege win. Or the three medals that comes with it. That's crappy. I'm sorry. But that's a very weird way to end this video. See, so I have no idea what to say. Oh my god. I, I don't know. <laughs> I, just, I just wasted like five, six minutes doing a siege to just... Uh, to just exit out last minute. Oh well, my bad. Whatever. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure to smack that like button and subscribe for more Pixcon 3D videos. If you guys did, make sure to smack that like button with your nose like this. And I'll see you guys next time. Oh, bye.